Here, I'll play one of your better ones. Here, <laughs> you, you, I'll play your. You want me to play your? Here, let's let's Motor have mouth? a choice. Okay. You got motor mouths. I got in front of me, and I have. Hold on. Jack and Rod uh, video game day. That's a great one too. We motor mouths fresh. Motor mouths, I like a lot. Yeah. We put Jack and Rod. in. How about Sour Shoes pranks the pizza place? Excellent one. What you want? What should I play? I'm going to play one of them right I'm now. Motor, motor mouths. mouths. Motor mouths. Yeah. Robin Motormouths it is. All right. Here they are in all their glory. <laughs> Thank you, Howard. This is Motormouth Radio. Hi, you're on with the Motormouths. Hey, guys. How are you today? Who's this? Hey, this is Rusty. Hey, Rusty. Hey, Rusty. What's up? How are you? Hey, I want to tell you guys, I know you guys are really into classic cars and stuff. I just wanted to kind of give you a great memory I had of my dad's old 69 Camaro that we recently sold. It was, you know, it was a rare Camaro with custom-built double fudge packers and imported Asian Bukaki chassis. And it also had a Mike Morales custom jizz soak dashboard. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a first for us. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's what you say. So, yeah. yeah, somebody knows how All to get us. All right, let's uh, grab the phone. Say hi, you're on with the motor mouths. Hey, guys, how you doing? Who's this? Uh, this is Jerry from Syosset. Hey, Jerry, what's going on? Nothing much. First of all, I'm, I'm here at, uh, you know, my son's uh, home from school today because he's sick, and unfortunately uh, that foul language is coming through. And uh, hopefully you can find who that moron was that just pranked, pranked you guys. Yeah, yeah, unfortunately we really can't find out who it is. We can just hang up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Well, all right. I had to explain it to him because it wasn't good. It wasn't pleasant. No, I understand. That's <laughs> why we get rid of those people. What's up automotively, Jerry? Anyway, maybe you guys can help me because I'm a car collector. I have a 65 Mustang. And are you guys familiar with the uh, custom-made, uh, the old-school Hearst shifter knob? Absolutely. Sure. sure. Yeah, the plain white ones. Mm -hmm. Yes. Well, I'm looking. I was wondering where can you guys possibly help me uh, get a new one? Um because I had this fat chick in the car. She sat in her and it got stuck in her quad. All righty. <laughs> Get out of here. Um, yes. Right, let's, try, let's try the phones. Hi, you're on with the motor mounts. Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing today? Who's this? Hey, this is Rich. I'm a big fan of the show. Listen every Thursday. I really appreciate what you guys do. Hey, thanks, Rich. Uh, yeah, thank you. I'm actually sitting out in my 73 uh, Chevy or Ford LTD. <laughs> nice. Which way are you wow. from? You local? Yeah, yeah. I'm from Hicksville. Oh, cool. cool. Yeah, yeah. I'm actually uh, sitting out in my car in the driveway uh, jerking off. I love you. Yeah, I get real turned on by the show. <laughs> All righty. Thanks, time. Rich. Yeah. So anyway, um, and I was actually getting excited that we had a new listener. Mm, yeah. Um, yes. The kid, uh, uh, yeah, whatever. <laughs> you, but you know, you don't know. That's the problem. You don't know. I'm talking about the phone light that's flashing. Uh, we don't, that, could, that could actually be a legitimate call. Uh, yeah. Let's go to the phones. How are you on with the motor mounts? Hey, it's Frank from Brentwood. How are you guys doing? Today? Okay, Frank. Um, uh, so uh, let's try the phones again. How are you on with the motor mounts? I drive an 07 Denali. Oh, okay. And who's this? Yeah. So what do you what do you know about cars? Not much. Well, who's this? <laughs> Who what do you want to ask me? Who are we talking to? Ernie Irvin. Ernie Irvin. Ernie Irvin. Oh, okay. Yeah, ask me a question. They ask you a question. Why do we want to ask you a question, Ernie? You called us. What's the question you're going to ask? Well, what's wrong with your car? That's why I got the audio show and you don't. Okay. Yeah, okay. And you got knowledge. Yeah, you got all the knowledge in the world. Well, no, that we don't have. That's absolutely not true. Yeah, good. Okay, so what, what about the Camaro? Okay, what about it? That's the question. What about the Camaro? That's what we asked. <laughs> Yeah, okay. That's a that's a Chrysler product, pal, not a GM product. The Camaro? <laughs> it's a piece of shit. Go look at the Dodge Challenger. Yeah. Oh, well, I, I was confused. <laughs> I was definitely confused. All right, let's try this again. Okay. Go higher on with the motor mounts. Hey, guys, it's John Hine from Hempstead. How you doing? Hiya, John. Hey, let me ask you something. Uh, what car has the best trunk to hide a schoolboy who's bleeding from his ass? <laughs> so, oh man, oh man, Dude, that crap that's really nasty. All right, let's try this. <laughs> I around the motor mounts. This ain't Hot Rod Magazine, pal. So anyway, I don't know. All righty, let's try this. I around the motor mounts. I said the Camaro's a piece of shit. That's what I said. You Holy know, it's smoke. we can't win. We are just no. It's this. amazing. Well, uh, looks like it, Ray. Wow. Oh, that was an interest interesting show. Wasn't yes, it? it was. Yeah, great. Bye.
Do these guys get any other calls, or is it just you guys? No, it was that just blinking us. light. Wow. <laughs> they get, they get, like, once in a while, they'll get a call, and if it's a legitimate one, they'll leave him on for 45 minutes. Wow. Like, they won't take a chance with any other calls. They'll just, and then we have to wait for that call. 